Assalamu alaikum my dear student. Today we will be going through the orientation lecture for 12th standard. And this in this orientation lecture, for it is basically for the commerce section. Already I have uploaded the video for the science section. So please go through it. It will be considering of, of what, what chapters will be coming in the IT subject for 12th and what are the weightage of that and so on. Before going to this video, please go through my channels and subscribe and, for the, and press a bell icon for the further notification and please share the video. Okay, now I'm starting up with my points. Now, dear student, before going through it, you must know this is one of the orientation lecture already I have told you, but before you are going to it, you must know about that. Key what is information technology? What is information technology? Already we have I have explained you, and we have gone through it. Okay, now we have gone through it. So this is uh, information technology. Nothing much to be gathering of all the information later whether it is and it is in nowadays information that is the IT sectors is a sector which having a wide scope in today's world okay there is no anything left out no any sections like whether you if you are in a commerce section whether you are in a science section whether you are in our section every section have covered up the it whether you want to make a video whether you want to write anything so everything is virtual representation so for you there is no that you can hide from it Nowadays, technology is so much vast. Now you're having a mobile also. You have 5G network and more and more things are there. So before going through it, I just go to a little uh, briefing. I have done it for yourself. So let me start up. The chapters with the theory part to be covered. First chapter this is the sixth chapter, but the first chapter is the advanced web designing. The second chapter is the digital marking. Third chapter is the computerized accounting with GST. Fourth chapter, e-commerce and e-governance. Fifth chapter, database concept using LIBO. And the sixth chapter, enterprise resource plan. This is a cha chapters which will be in the theory part. Now, the chapter which should be in the practical part for IT, that is advanced web designing, digital marketing, computers accounting with GST and the last database concept using the LIBOR. This four chapter is of also with the, it is also in the theory part as well as in the practical part. Okay, now you will be asking why, why it's so that it is also in the theory part because the MCQ's questions will be there, which will be there in your theory also. So there should be Now, as a chapter wise, it is a marks distribution. If you have seen here, marks with option, it is total of 96 and the exact math or the total marks which will be covered, that is the 80 marks will be of the in the board exam that will be. So, so according to that also is there and according to this or that with option. With option is why it, it have given you, there will be a choice for you to take any of the questions. It is, it is a choice that you can take it and with options it many of them will be benefited if you don't know any some of the question you can go with it but basically if you have seen here the chapter number second and chapter number fifth these two uh, chapters doesn't consist of any marks with options means this chapter you have to go through it okay each and every point so hope you understood the weightage i already given you have advanced web design with options 30 with mark that is the exact max 20 digital market weightage with option is 15 with then the exact max is 15 and so on so hopefully i'm not explaining the whole because of, from the screen itself you will be able to understand it okay next what we are having that is question wise marks distributions so if you have seen from chapter number one uh, from the chapter number one uh, that question number one two three four is coming from all the chapter that is one, two, three, four. Now, in question number five, it will be basically consisting from first and second, and question number six basically consists of uh, two, three, four, and six chapter. And question number seven will be taking most probably the theory that is your tally, your uh, ERP, and e governance, or that is e commerce, th three, four, and six. And, uh, chap and next, the question number eight. 
will be consist of two part a and b and both of them will be in, uh, again in two part the question whether you can take from any of that and you can attempt any one of them from question a and go from our question b next what we are having we are having the distribution according to the chapter wise so if you have seen in the fill ups part the weightage of the second chapter is most probably there four marks okay similarly if you have seen through for false the weightage of second chapter again then mcqs if you have seen again digital marking weightage is more okay and then comes the erp okay next in mcqs if you have seen mcqs the four you have they have not given in digital but there will be a question because it consists of with options so there will be a question there itself so weightage most probably is of computerized accounting okay mcqs 3 only from first and second chapter i already told you match the column most probably from second third fourth and sixth chapter it will be short answer most probably again i have told you third fourth and sixth chapter that is computerized account e-commerce and erp and the show programs will be only from the first chapter that is advanced web designing and total marks already they have made how they have distributed it next the practical in this practice any one of the uh, practical there are four uh, practicals and out of that any one of them it will be take asking you but here you after any one in that you have to write the handwritten code whatever coding